Good afternoon. <coughs> That's me, I'm Michelle Hughes. I'm with the Regional Partnerships team here at State Library of Queensland. And if you've, as you've seen, uh, everyone's been talking about data today and it's not a very pretty thing. Um, so annually, State Library of Queensland collects statistical data from the public libraries. And it's things like uh, how many visits they had, how many loans they made. And we package that up and we release it in two different ways. So we put a CSV file onto the government open data portal we also publish it on the Public Libraries Connect website as a PDF, <laughs> which looks a bit like that. So it's about 48 pages of PDF spreadsheets, um, not the most useful file type that you can access. So as part of, um, oh, fun fact, we also, State Library of Queensland, does the collation for the Australian um, statistics every year for all of the um, public libraries across Australia. So we've got a lot of experience with data. So what we wanted to do actually was to see if we could make it a bit prettier and a bit easier to use through data visualisation. Now, people comprehend data better through pictures apparently, and as you saw with uh, one of the videos earlier, you can make some really beautiful and um, intriguing visualisations using data. And if you go onto the internet, you can do a search and find all sorts of different data that's been visualised using video or infographics and even in your Facebook stream infographics pop up on a daily basis. So what we wanted to do was make an interactive visualisation using the data that public libraries provide to us annually um, and we commissioned about two years ago the development of a prototype tool. Uh, so we used a local firm who took the data, identified some of the main interesting um, data sets that they could use and they turned it into this. So it's freely available on the internet and I'll, I'll give you the link to it at the end if you're interested in having a look. It's a little bit hard to find, I have to admit. It's still in prototype phase. So what it does is take uh, the top, if you look up on the left hand side, you'll see the main data sets that we used and they're the general ones that libraries tend to focus on quite a lot. Now some of the things that we use data for is to uh, assist discovery and we also use it as benchmarking and to set KPIs. And this is what public libraries in Queensland use it for a lot as well. But generally trying to access it through a PDF isn't you know, that useful, as I mentioned. So with this, we're hoping that public libraries can get in and interrogate their own data and match themselves against the data provided by other public library services across Queensland to assist them to set their benchmarking KPIs. Uh, so. Another thing we're also interested in using it for is advocacy. So how do you use data as an advocacy tool? Well, data surprisingly is really good at telling stories. Now you probably can't see that from this too well and I'd love to show you some of the visualizations that are available on the internet. So really go and check some out. But if you can see in the middle, there's a stacked line graph. And if you were able to get into the interactive version, this is just a JPEG you'd be able to interrogate all of those dots and each dot represents a different set of statistics. And if you go further and further down, you can actually interrogate all the way down to an individual library service and you can bring up data sets that you can interrogate to find a story of what were they doing at a particular year? Why did their memberships go up? Why did their visits go like through the roof? Why are their loans going down? And that can set you onto a journey of trying to find out the story around the library service that the data is really just hinting at. So for the future, as I said, this is just a prototype. And there's the link now if you want to go and have a look. But uh, well, not now. <laughs> uh, but you can also find that on the Public Libraries Connect website. Just do a search for data visualization tool. Um, so yeah, for the future, what we're going to do going forward is assess this particular tool and ask the public libraries what they think of it and how they would like to use it and really try and interrogate how we can use it as an advocacy tool ourselves to advocate on behalf of the public libraries to state government to their own councils. So stay tuned, I guess. <laughs>